Hello everybody, welcome to the first standalone video of Medieval Dynasty on my channel. Uh, if you are a returning subscriber and do not know what this game is, that's okay, I got you. I'm gonna read the description straight from Steam. Hunt, survive, build, and lead in the harsh medieval ages. Create your own medieval dynasty and ensure its long-lasting prosperity or die trying. So if that sounds like something you would be into, stick around. I'm going to be doing a little a little tour around the village. I'm uh, going to be showing you showing you my farms and where my uh, people sleep as well as just other areas in the village. But yeah, uh, let's get into it then. This is around the area you spawn in when you first start the game. This is Gustovia. It's a nice little town. They have your your basic stuff for farming and they have some manure, uh, fertilizer, really anything you need to get going. Um, I decided not to venture too far just for that reason. It makes it easier paying taxes and stuff like that. But this is the campfire. This is where you recruit all of the people that you would like to ask to join your village. Help farm, help make things, help hunt. So, if you just continue down this road, you will eventually arrive to my village. Just veer off left. And this is where I plopped my first home. I believe it was this one right up here. Now it's been upgraded. It's insulated. Uh, one of my villagers lives in it now. Um, but yeah, this is where I started. There used to be a whole lot more trees here. Um, I'm sure if you play the game, this part may look familiar. There's some clay piles here. Um, which is nice. It helped early, but now I have... I have some people helping me out there. Uh, this is the well. Food storage here. Wonder, how can I use my cursor? Here, I'll turn this back on. There. I will point the center dot. That's where I am describing. So that there's the well. This is where you fill up your buckets and your water skins. Currently, it looks like she has everything done. And then up here, just a little bit more, this is the food storage. Uh, and then here you have the, I forget what it's called exactly. Can I get close enough? The, yeah, woodshed. Before we go any farther, let's, let's go on back. This here is the kitchen. <laughs> I have some logs. Huh, I forgot about those kitchen this is your wood crafting area your workshop easy there Jack I forgot to mention this is my donkey Jack I think I've only had him I think I got him at the beginning of the season it is currently the third day of summer I'm not gonna worry too much about what my what my villagers are up to I know I'm a little behind on making sure I have enough seeds for them to plant, but just for this tour, I'm not gonna worry too much about them. Well, this is the sewing hut. And on yonder, this here is my barn. This here is one of my farming huts. This is right here is where I have them do most of the farming. Uh, up the hill, you will see later on, I have some more fields up there, but it's not, <laughs> The village kind of grew a little quick, and I have things plopped for future future growth. But uh, I've restricted them mostly over here. I do have a couple people up there that I'll, sh I'll just show you on later. It'll, it'll be easier to explain. Um, but here, this is my smithing house. This here is the shed storage. I'm going to jump off the donkey. 
house number one, villager house, this one as well, this one here too. I decided to build a little fence around this one. Just testing some stuff out. This is the house I'm currently living in. There's my son. Bernard. Wee little lad. This is Jack's pen. Um, we have another house right here, I think. Yep, that's a house. So this is where the majority of them sleep. Um, like I said, this is my house here. But yeah, you can see the orchard. We have fields this way. They go up almost to the top of the hill. Uh, that's another house. And yeah, up here is... I forget again what these are called. Let's go check it out. Um, excavation sheds. I have two of these. Um, I, had to, I had to plop another one down. I needed more people going out and getting you know, clay and stuff like that. I was trying to insulate all these houses and slowly upgrading them rather than building new ones. I think I have a good population right now. I just need to upgrade all my buildings. And then, yeah, then I'll then I'll think about growing, growing more, getting more farming down. Because I, I think that's mostly how I make my money right now is selling, you know, selling stuff that you just grow. Uh, but yep, here's another house, bigger one there, one right here. This here is my hunting shed. Yeah, this all used to be hunt <laughs> trees. I chopped a bunch down for those fields over there. This here is another house. Um, but yep, this is this is the lower portion. I've decided to take over this hill. I like being able to see down once you get up all the way up here it's just a nice perspective we got more fields here like i said i got a couple couple villagers who run these ones um we got, decided to build along this path just makes it easier when it's night going back down some more orchards some more trees another farming shed this is where I have the villagers sleep for for the ones who work here and tend to the fields. And this is my new storage. Since I plan to keep going up the hill, I don't know. I don't know a whole lot about the mechanics of the game, but I don't know. I like plopping stuff for, for, for the look of it as well. You know, it may take some time for them to, you know, run up here and play stuff and get stuff, but... I like the look of it. I wanted to keep going up the hill. So yep, that's that's what I'm in the process of getting resources for. Um, and then also, if you go down this way, I have my first pig pen. No pigs. I have it down ready. Like I said, I kind of got crazy with it and just wanted to keep building buildings. And So I had to hit the brakes on that. I got to... Like I said, upgrade my houses, my buildings. Over the seasons, they get destroyed and you have to repair them. Um, oh, also, I forgot. There is one more. I have a fishing shed down this way. So just behind the main portion of the village I have plopped down a fishing hut it made me plop it all the way in the water I thought maybe I could get the the stairs up on the land but it was not having it so it's all the way in the water they're gonna get their feet wet but that's okay no one's working here yet but nice little spot I'd work here that's for sure so I think that's pretty much it. Um, let me think. Yeah, I think that's it. This summer wasn't that great. It's been a while since I jumped back on the game. I've been editing videos, so I kind of forgot the flow of things. I'm gonna have to get back into that. 
if I'm gonna start playing again, which I'd like to. I love this game. I finally got a got a new graphics card. I was running a, a 970 when I first got this game, and whew, it wasn't that great of a experience. So I had to put the game up for a little while, and then recently I just got a new card. So I've been playing it. I've been loving it. It's a good it's a good hobby. I like doing you know late at night. That's when I enjoy it the most. Um, but yeah, thank you for checking out this portion of the video. My little intro to the village. We're going to be expanding. We're upgrading. We're going to make the villagers the happiest they can be. Um, but this video is not over completely. Right after this, I have some clips that I just randomly hit record while I was playing. Me and Morgan were playing some games. I wanted some some footage to practice editing on. Uh, I made it goofy. I made it cheesy. There's some dialogue at the beginning. Um, I just was having fun. I was really just using it to to learn, you know, Premiere Pro. I've messed with it before, and it's just a learning curve. So I gave myself some stuff to work with, and I decided to upload it. Um, the part after this, I'm doing like a little recap. The first portion I put in the first episode, the first queued up episode at the end. Uh, I don't expect you to go back and watch that, so I just put a little montage at the beginning of the new stuff. Um, but yeah, like I said, it's silly, it's cheesy, but I hope you get the idea of it. It was just something for me to practice on, and I don't know, I had fun. But yeah, thanks again. Uh, like I said, remember, timestamps in the description. Um, if you enjoyed, leave a comment, like, subscribe, turn on the notif notifications to be notified when I upload. But yeah, thank you very much, and uh, until next time, adios. Enjoy the next clips. Oh yeah, you run. Oh, he, he juked me. Oh, come on now. Let's go. Only one more. Coming in guns blazing now. Dang, anything good? Iron knife. Screw it, I'll take it all. Oh, jiggly. Jack. <laughs> yep, big guy. Road through the morning. Bandits. Four o'clock in the morning. Is it dying? Vision for hope that he'll live another day. Yeah. yeah. He's happy. Yeah, he is. He's got a nice hat. 
He's over there playing Sims. Simming it up. Good morning. Where is your campfire? There it is. Say hello, Jack. Might be a new person tending after you. Well, maybe not. Say that name. Oh my gosh. What? Oh, oh, I can't. Wait. Is this Frida? Is this Frida? Is this Frida? Is that an S? No, it's a Z Y G. Oh, Zigfrida. Zigfrida. I might take you just for your dang name. You got good good stats. You only got two farming, but I need another miner and I guess uh hmm. Hey old Let's friend. Dig a little deeper. <laughs> Let me hear about your skills. Yeah, so obviously you'd be a good saleswoman. What don't you like doing? You meet the real craftsman by the way he finishes, not the way he starts. Unfortunately, my enthusiasm drops quite fast. And I immediately want to try something else. Fair enough. Goodbye. Might get back to you. Do we have enough craftsmen? So you could work in the field, okay. All right. Hello. Let's take you home, Zig, Zig Frida. Well, you're gonna walk, but yeah. Yep. Excellent. Some other business we had to do. Literally, gotta sell some stuff. You're still sleeping. What's this dude doing? Be welcomed, stranger. Oh, I feel you, man. Dang weather. Goodbye. This person's up. Yes, here they come, here they come. Hello there. My wares never disappoint. You got enough coin? Take the rest of my... wheat. Thank you. Uh, sure, take my beer bottle. Take my wine bottle, that's it. Okay, farewell. See Thank you soon. You. Zigfrida! Zigfrida! Got quite the squad building up here. Hopefully I can keep them all happy. Got you a fresh house here. Don't be sad. You're not even there yet. 